Hello and welcome to Kachu Travels, which is basically documenting all the travels that me and my son Nandu do. Today I'm going to talk about a very important thing in case you're planning to do a road trip. Fast tag. How easy is it to get a fast tag? How easy is it to basically stick the fast tag sticker on your car? And is it accepted at all toll booths? That's what this video is largely aiming to uncover. Please subscribe to Kachu Travels on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook and of course my own blog www.kachutravels.com Now the first thing, getting a fast tag. You can apply for a fast tag through any of the bank outlets. Now in case you don't want to go to a bank, you can always go online on ICICI, on Paytm, on Axis Bank and a host of other banks and go apply. Now I went through Axis Bank, I paid about 200 rupees online and it took about 7 to 8 days for a blue dot courier to arrive at my home. But from all that I've seen in the app on ICICI mobile as well as on ATM, I've seen that it's far easier to recharge because they have a dedicated screen for that. They don't have it on Access Bank. And uh, the Access Bank UPI for me did not work. I don't know because if it was due to my card number being nine digits, because most card numbers are 10 digits. So in case you have uh, a case like that where uh, you don't conform to some of the recent regulations of a 10 digit car number, then Access Bank is definitely not very friendly. And uh, secondly, on the Access Bank mobile option, if you miss the UPI option, there is no other easy way to recharge. So the only other way is to go on a desktop. There is a URL that I'm you know, just showing on your screen now. You need to click that URL on a desktop, then go pay your money through a credit card and that's the only way you'll recharge. Hello everyone. As Indians, we don't really move to a system unless we are forced to. And that exactly is the same with Fastag. Now the, now the Fastag has been there for maybe the last 3-4 years or maybe even more. But I've never thought about actually getting a Fastag because I probably did not know where to go get it and how to go stick it. But now that the government has mandated Fastag to be stuck, I've got the Fastag sticker and I'm going to show you how to stick it and how to pay it. So are you ready Nandu? We're just hoping it's going to be lesser waiting times at toll plazas. So, here I am. I've got the uh, fast tag sticker. I'm just going to now take it out and I'm going to show you how to basically stick this up your car so that it's being detected. Uh, it says that you have to stick it exactly in the center point of your windscreen, uh, top center point. So, to me, that would basically be at this point, which is. Uh, just behind the rear view mirror. So let's get ahead and stick it there. I want to stick it. Yeah, yeah we can stick it together. Today, I went out to take a little test drive to understand what outlets accept fast tag and what don't. So uh, I joined the Nice Road and Nice Road in Bangalore does not yet accept fast tag. I had to go all the way up till the electronic city toll or rather a little after that and that was the first point, it's called Atibele. That was the first point that accepts fast tag. And uh, one of the problems is uh, at that toll, which is also today a, uh, you know, a cash plus uh, fast tag toll, it wasn't very easy to know whether the fast tag got accepted because the uh, person at the counter is asking you to move and just like they're doing to so many other people so there is no signal and the sms that uh, is supposed to come usually comes about 20 minutes late so the only other uh, notification that you get is on email um, which is again uh, another screen so that way i still think the experience is not very fluid it's it's, it's broken at parts but yes, it worked at the Atibele toll. I got the notification a little later. So that experience is still broken. 
and uh, from what i heard in a conversation with the um, nice road toll people that they're more likely to accept fast tags from january uh, so uh, fast tag accepted yet but we will be uh, the nice expressway is going to be having it from january which is still good news so thank you so that way uh, while from whatever little i've seen fast tag acceptance is slowly increasing but also be prepared in the months of december 2019 and maybe a little bit of january 2020 you will have huge huge queue lines at uh, various toll booths because of this confusion some are trying to apply for a fast tag some are trying to uh, you know uh, mix the fast tag as well as the normal cash outlet this confusion is going to take a couple of months to go and uh, i please do not expect that uh, the queues will be any lesser if at all the queues will be more because there is some confusion right now at the moment so my advice is to start early or start very late in the evening when you possibly don't expect a lot of traffic to pile on so that's it from us uh, here's us wishing you uh, a very happy road trip and a very happy christmas bar new year it's the festive season that's kicking up where everybody's traveling everyone's on vacation so here's to happy vacations happy vacations okay please subscribe to kachu travels on youtube instagram Facebook and of course my own blog www.kachutravels.com